Hello everybody, it's Blockaduck, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to download and install World Edit for Minecraft 1.18.1. If you enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing and sharing this video with your friends. Alright everybody, let's jump right into today's video. Alright everybody, so to download and install World Edit, the first thing that you need to do is you need to either download Forge or Fabric for Minecraft 1.18.1. It doesn't matter which one you download because they both work the same and the file for the World Edit is the same for both Forge and Fabric, but you do need to download either Forge or Fabric before you download World Edit. So, I'm going to be downloading Fabric for this tutorial and here we are on the Fabric download page. I'll put links to the Fabric and the Forge download pages in the video description so that you can easily um, go to those pages and download Forge and Fabric. And it is very important to download Fabric or Forge before you download World Edit because um, Fabric and Forge are the programs that World Edit runs on. So here we are on the Fabric installation page and the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to click on where it says download for Windows. If you don't have a Windows computer you can click on this download universal jar and it will go ahead and download the Fabric install for you as well and even if you do have a windows computer you can still click on that if you want either one will work for windows and the universal jar will work for anything besides a windows so now that we have our fabric installer we're going to go ahead and click on that little arrow at the bottom left corner and click on where it says open and this is going to go ahead and open up the fabric installer for us so here we are under the fabric installer. Now under the micro version, you want to make sure that 1.18.1 is selected. Don't choose 1.18, choose 1.18.1. There is a difference. Make sure that you um, basically keep the loader version the same that should be ready. And then when after you've selected the version, you want to click on the install button and then click on the Microsoft Store slash Xbox and it will say fabric loader has been successfully installed so we can click on the ok button so now we can close out of this fabric page and move on to downloading world edit itself so this is the world edit page and i will also put a link to the world edit page in the video description so that you can easily get to this website in order to download world edit now we're just going to choose this top version up here that says forge and fabric for mc 1.18.1 you can also scroll down here and you can see all of the different downloads and as you can see at the very top it says forge fabric for 1.18.1 we're going to go ahead and click on this download button right here and it will say that our download will begin in one second at counting down from five and as you can see the world edit file is downloading so now that the world edit file is downloading we can go ahead and open up the micro folder to put the mod in to do that you want to go ahead and open up the search bar of your computer and if you're on a windows then just click on that little um, window right there and you want to enter in percentage app data percentage and this will work whether you're on a windows mac linux whatever kind of computer program you use just open up your computer search bar and type in percentage app data percentage and then hit on that um, app data file right there this is going to go ahead and open up your dot minecraft folder so what you want to do here is click on where it says dot minecraft and now you want to click on where it says mods if you don't have a mods folder then you can just easily create one by right clicking clicking on new folder and then naming the folder mods mods all lowercase like that now it's not going to let me create a mods folder because i already have a mods folder but if you've never installed mods before then you can very easily create a mods folder so once you find your mods folder just go ahead and click on that and it will go ahead and show all of the mods that we have right here now we're going to go ahead and minimize out of this for a moment don't close out of it just minimize out of it and we're going to go ahead and click on this little arrow and we're going to click on where it says show in folder right here and this is going to open up our downloads folder and it will have the world edit installer selected by default and now we are going to open up our mods folder again so we have both of them open at the same time and we're just going to drag and drop the world edit mod from our downloads folder straight into our minecraft mods folder there we go now we can close out of both of these and we can close out of Google, we can close out of my recorder, and we can open up Minecraft Java Edition. To do that, just double tap on the Minecraft Java Edition and it will go ahead and open up for you. 
Once Minecraft Java Edition is launched, you can go ahead and select Fabric Loader 1.18.1. And as you can see, it already selected it by default. You, but if it didn't, you can just click on this little menu and it will show all of your different Minecraft installations. And you can just click on the one that says Fabric Loader 1.18.1 and then click on where it says Play. Now you want to click on this little checkbox right here that's just a Minecraft Privacy Notice. Click on where it says Play and Minecraft Java Edition will launch. Alright everybody, so as you can see, I am in game, and if I enter in the command double slash double slash wand and hit enter, you can see the wand pop up into my inventory, and then um, if I jump up and down, I can go ahead and select different positions and just do all of the world edit commands like that. And so that is pretty much all you have to do in order to download and install world edit for Minecraft 1.18.1.